So, do you guys, do you guys wait till you saw the sunrise? Oh god, man. I'll try to copy the fucking name of the song. <laughs> I'll try to do a pun with it and it feel badly. Hello everyone, my name is Bokusatsu, and here today we're going to review the essay figure arts. Common Rider Black Sun. Yes, you hear me right? Wait a minute, Common Rider Black? This, 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 this is a Common Rider Black? Well, no. yes and no. This is a modern take of the character, of the version of the character in the late, in the current, well, showed up on, on Amazon Prime right now, Comrade Black Sun. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna sound biased as it is, cause I love this show, but if you haven't watched Black Sun, go make an Amazon Prime account. For all my, for people, okay, yeah, it's on Amazon Prime. If you have Amazon Prime, go watch it, it's really good. It's one of my favorite, it's actually my favorite, like, comedy show for Toku of 2022. It's so good. I can't explain why. I have so much stuff on it, but yeah. So, t it, so today we're going to talk about, well, the figure! Let me move these boxes out of the way. The figure! Sorry, sorry about that. Well, yeah, today we're gonna talk about the figure. The good, the bad, do I have any gripe with it, do I have any issues with it? I have a few. Alright, let's start. Sorry. Scope and Rise, this looked like the actual show. Wait, what? This suit looked like the actual suit for the show itself, it's so good. His articulation is some articulation reminds me of a sink of the of a Senkoku Seiho and I say that a nice way to pop the cut. It's pretty slick and relaxing as well. You can pose him, you can you can make him do like any pose you want to. From the show or from the original black or from the original uh cover of black show. Alright, I'm gonna be honest taken. I actually don't. I, I actually don't. I actually uh, don't like Comrade Black. I find the show pretty boring. The only character in the show that I like that caught my attention was Shadow Moon. Well, Shadow Moon is cultural. Besides that, that's pretty much it. I didn't care about anyone else. So back on the thing, yeah, this suit. It's, so good. it's like a monster. Slash kaiju form of well, Kamen of Kamen Rider. Also, you can tell they have like a little dust in it. So, well, this thing been in my collection since well, a couple since about a couple of uh, weeks. So yeah. So articulation wise, how is he? Well, well, this is how far his articulation is. You go back, you go over here, and over here. This is how far, this is how far he uh, goes for that. Ooh, gotta be careful. Oh, hold on. Don't want to break any of these figures. Sorry about that. I have, I have, I have a couple of figures that almost fell down. But uh, yeah, so this is it. This is how far his uh, legs go. Now, I will say, the, the RQC issue with this guy. Where the QC issue? First time getting this guy, he was really tight. I can say it was annoying, yes. But I had to play with him like a couple more times. He got more and more looser. I will say, if if we had like some type of oil or glue that you use to loosen your figures up, use it for Black Sun because his legs are tight as fuck. 
I haven't used any body right? to fucking clarify that because well, I don't trust myself with, with, with fucking silicon or whatever. I don't I will call it silicon, but I don't trust myself with with that stuff. So yeah. Also, yeah, again, he can pose pretty well. This is this is how far his neck goes from here to here. And to here. You can literally do like you can literally copy that one the freaking cover of the soundtrack by doing this. <laughs> God, I love this figure. This figure is so good. Also, there's the driver for those that for those that have the CSM or pre-order. You definitely need this guy. Just saying. Before I get anywhere, ask me. Wait, how do you have him? I have the Japanese release. I bought it off Ami Ami last year. I'm not sponsored by the way. So yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Oh well. Uh, I'm so I'm so sorry. But uh, yeah, talk about articulation, his well scope and all that. So let's go on to accessory because I'm boy. Mr. Cultural over here has a lot of accessories. And when I mean a lot, boy, I mean a lot, boy. I mean a lot. Alright. Fuck. So, we have these. We can't see them. So we have like, so we have like a shoppable chest piece that we can, we can, we can move out. We can take these, you can take this whole thing off and put in these two if we want to. Also, yeah, I forgot to tell you, uh, this figure has shop, this figure has swappable chest pieces. So if you have like the single Crusade hold dental figures or kind of like evil, then yeah. Here we have his, well, his sword. I will say this, if you want, if you want to hold the sword, take this, take this off. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Sorry. And put it on here because, well, you see that there's a, there's a non sharp spot right there for him, for him to put his sword on. I don't know why, but when I first got this, it was it was it was on this sword instead. I don't know why. I kind of find that annoying, but whatever. But yeah, here's the sword. You can you can recreate multiple fight scene from the show if you want if you wanted to. <laughs> oh my god, this guy has so many hands. What the hell? So we have his, uh, well, I don't know what the fuck to call these. So he has like his somewhat posing hands. He, he, uh, you have his somewhat posing hand. He could do that, he could do that one pose, like, well, from coming in black and all. So if you know what pose I'm talking about, you know what pose I'm talking about. Because, well, Black Sun, base, Black Sun. Black Sun is a 50th anniversary project in the making. Uh, it was paying homage to like the whole entire show. In this, in the small references, references as well. And I love this. Talk about Black Sun could get me emotional. Cause that's what that's what hit me for personal reasons. So we have Ah shit. Feel all of it. So we have his fisted hands, and uh, that's cool. It's actually cool. I'm not gonna lie. We have his, we have his, we have his uh, attached 
sharp. It happened like it happened. What the fuck? We have his uh, attached hand, well, open palm hands. You can use to get to hold or do like like fighting poses with. Because well, this suit did kill a lot of kaiju, evil kaiju, meant to say, in the show. Does he want? Yeah. Okay, we have his uh, hands to hold his weapon, his sword. You know, yeah, that's that's all. That's all he comes with. So, on to size comparison. Oh boy, let's do this, shall we? Have like a, have, we have like a lot of figures to compare. With. All right, just for just because, look at, look, look because since this is Black Sun, and since I don't have the I don't have the Black Sun for the Black Sun version of Shadow Moon when the video comes when this video is uh, out yet. Yeah, when the video's out. Here he is with the SA figure art Senkoku Seho Shadow Moon. And here he is with the SA figures Kamara Zeronos Senkoku Seho as well. Damn, that looks pretty good, not gonna lie. I will do a video on Zerono, don't worry. God damn, this, this, this light works so well for Shadow Moon. His Satan Saber. <laughs> Alright, let's move that out of the way. Since it's a Shadow Moon, let's just put it in the background because, well, yeah. <laughs> Here he is with the SA figure of Kamari Chalice. And here he is with the with the SA figure of Kamari Sibella. The last figure I reviewed in uh, 2022. Oh yeah, right, 2023 I made this video, so happy new year to everyone. <laughs> and uh Honestly, damn, he he skill he skills pretty well. With, he skills skill. He stands the scales pretty well with both of them. With a old school SHF at Chalice and a new school SHF at Draco. Here he is with the SA figure Kamara Sibella. Here he is with the Lightning Collection Lost Galaxy Green. Here he is with the SA figure Marvel of uh, Venom. Oh yeah, you can <laughs> Oh yeah, Venom's a big boy, you can tell. I, I have so many cool ideas for both those figures. I wanna take pictures of not right now, but I'm gonna wait. You can uh honestly okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna have my different, but uh, you can honestly tell that uh You can honestly tell that uh, Venom way taller than Damon and Kotaro. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. God damn it. <laughs> uh, yes, I really do review on this figure. Just wait. I want to take pictures of him first. God, I have a lot of good things to say about that guy. Trust me. And uh, that's it. That, that's the video. Thank you all for watching. Now, if you watch the video, and we ask me, where do you get him? Well, I, how do you get him? Well, wait. The US release for Black Sun is this year. But if you're impatient, there is a Japanese release. Now, if you want the Japanese release, you can also buy him from Nin Nin. Also, let me say this. Kamen Shadow Moon is Premier Bandai, and for U.S. fans, for U.S. customers, U.S. fans of Kamen Rider, I recommend you using Premier Bandai U USA for him. Now I, I have a pre-order, so I can't even get mine. But I didn't. But I don't have a Premier Bandai account, unfortunately. So I can't. So I did. So I did. So I didn't use the website to get my Shadow Moon. No. I bought the Japanese release. 
And this guy is a regular. Also, 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 come on, Black Sun is is a regular release as well. So I, I recommend I recommend waiting for US release to get him, or on the Japanese release. He's on Indian Games for a decent price. So yeah, guy. Thank, thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Follow all my shows so me as in the description. And uh, and yeah, guys. My name's Aaron, and uh, hope you all have uh, hope you all have an amazing year that's 2023. Because I have I have found out this year is gonna help me release my full potential. Kingstone Flash. Hi, I forgot I forgot to say it in the video. But uh pre like comment and subscribe because well with your guys' help I can reach one thousand I can reach one thousand subscribers this year. And stay tuned for my, stay tuned for my next video that is well my podcast episode, the Broku Cast with in that episode I'll be talking about Abba Ranger. So yeah, that's gonna be fun. Till next time, till next time, guy. I'm out. Peace.